Hi, so in today's project I'm going to show you how to make a little quick gift card holder but I'm going to use a decoration that's within Scan & Cut Canvas and send it over to my machine. Now I'm in Scan & Cut Canvas and I'm on the Canvas Projects tab and I'm going to scroll down until I find the file that I want. Okay, so this is the project that I'm, I'm, I want to open. It's the Poinsettia Wine Bottle Tag. I'm going to select it and then I'm going to choose, there's an A and a B. I'm going to choose B and I'm going to choose the first icon which appears when you hover over it and it, it'll bring up a message that says import parts. I'm going to say OK, OK and that's going to put that onto my mat. Now the first thing I'm going to do is just line everything up on top of each other. Just bring this to the front so that's a right click Select this, right click, bring to front and then do the same with this because you can see it's going behind. So select, right click, bring to front. Just put it all on top of each other, drag an imaginary box around everything and right click and group. And I'm going to make it so it's 2.99 wide. So I'm just watching this measurement here as I drag it in from the corner. And the reason I'm doing that is because the area that I've got on the front of my gift card holder is about three inches or there or thereabouts. So now I'm going to ungroup it. I'm going to put the pieces separately that I'm going to cut together. So I'm going to cut the green leaf swirl shape in green. These two pieces I'm going to cut in red and this one I'm going to see if I've got an alternative colour that I can use. So now you'll see that it's coming with its generic name so I'm going to highlight that and delete it. I'm going to give it a name and save it into my canvas projects. Say OK. Now I'm going to come to download and I'm going to send it over wirelessly to the machine and then I'm going to click close and I can close that down now and I'm going to go to the machine, show you how to retrieve the file and then show you how to put this project together with the gift card holder. Okay so I've got the machine switched on, I'm going to go to pattern, I'm going to come up to here to the Wi-Fi transfer if you've brought yours over on USB, plug your USB into the side of your machine and then you would go to save data and go to your USB stick. I'm just going to go back, Wi-Fi transfer, wait for the file to come over and there's the file. And then I would save it, so I would hit save, put it in the machine. It's going to tell me it's saved and it's pattern 219. So I'm going to say OK. Now from here, I'm going to load up my mat with my bits of card and I'm going to do a background scan and cut out the shapes and then I'll show you how to assemble it all to go with the project. OK, to save a bit of time, I've cut all the parts, but although I've cut this and I cut it in an alternative colour, it doesn't really go with the red that I want to use, so I'm not going to use it. I've got a small, tiny brad. I've just bent these leaves with a bone folder a little bit, and I'm going to put this brad through the middle and fasten this together. Just bending up the leaves a little bit just to give them a bit of dimension. So that's the decoration. So now you need a piece of pattern paper or lightweight card. This is some old stamping up paper um, but it's like a very lightweight card. Double side works better but if you're using a card use a card that's got a solid core so it's the same colour on both sides. And basically, you need a piece of six by six. 
you're going to fold it in half point to point and then use a bone folder to get a nice crisp crease so now you're going to bring one of the points up so it comes up here so you want it to come so that this is in a straight line. And then again, burnish it with your bone folder. So that's how it's looking now. Then you're going to bring this side over. To line up and because this is quite thick especially when it's doubled up you just really need to crease it with your bone folder so you've got something that looks like this so now I'm going to apply a little bit of glue here you do is you bring this front flap down along this line and that is your little pocket for your gift card so now I'm going to get this and stick this on the front So I'm just using a 3D foam pad. Just bringing the leaves up a little bit to give it some dimension and then you stick it on here. And this is why I made this 2.99 inches wide in canvas because this measures about three inches across. I'm just gonna stick that on there, like so. I've not got a gift card handy, but I've got a little store card. So that's your gift card holder. You could put a little greeting on if you want, or you could cut a little greeting and just stick it on the back there. And the actual finished size of this Is about four and a half by four so if you, it would fit comfortably in a five by five envelope if you wanted to put it in an envelope you could punch a hole in it and hang it on a tree anything really but again just another simple quick Christmas decoration idea please give the video a thumbs up if you liked it don't forget to subscribe if you don't already do so and I'll see you in the next video thank you